Okay guys, here back in Forensic, we're going to show you how to do another thing. This is marble stone on top of KS, okay? That's the proper procedure how to do it. You want to go right on top of the Forensic Primer. You want to put the marble, Marmarino KS and then the marble stone right on top. So I'm going to show you the demonstration of how to put the Marmarino KS on first. Very simple. During your trial. Always from dry to wet, always circular motions. Now, you will get a little scratch here and there it's because this product has sand in it, so that's normal. But you can just come back over it and fix it. Try to do long movements so you can get the job done quicker. Try to do it nice and smooth. Always control the product in your trial. That's it. Try to do as smooth as you can. You're done. Now when this dries, it looks like that. Remember, anything with lime dries like 40% lighter. So if you have any rough spots, you can easily knock it down. Inside corners, you're going to send them down. Outside corners, send them down too. This is what your first coat should look like. Yes. Now we're going to do the second coat of marble stone. The reason why they call it marble stone is because they throw black pieces of marble stone into the line. Come back. Nice and tight. You will get chatter when you do this because of the black pieces of marble stone in it. So you want to hit it in different directions to make that tire go away. See that? No more tire. What do you mean by chatter? Chatter? You see that? Ah, gotcha. That's because of the black pieces of marble stone in it. So we have to compress the black pieces of marble stone into the Marino KS. So it's bouncing on that. that your trial is bouncing basically. Yeah. See? I, I compress it in. Now it's nice and smooth. The lens is a little dirty. We're going to take a lens cleaning. With that, you have to wet, wet it. You can't just do it with dry one. This okay, hold on, let me spit on it. So this is how we do it here in forensic. You know, mm -hmm. we don't even stop. We just keep going. Mm -hmm. We clean the lens while the wood is still plain. Very simple. Two core application. Can't beat it. And that's how you do marble stone. Yeah, I'm a stone. Okay. Could you wet your trowel and make it even smoother? Yes. What you could do is you get a, a water bottle too. You can spray the wall down. 
Come back with the trial. See all that? Makes it a lot more smoother. You can do that basically with any product except the fine marmarino. Now, when this dries, it's going to look like that. And I'm going to show you a quick technique of how to soap it. Come back with some soap on your trial. Always in circular motion, nice and tight. Try to do long strokes. See how long the soap goes. Goes pretty long. Remember, before you buff it, you gotta wait until it dries a little bit, somewhat, and then you can buff it. You don't want to buff it right away because it's still wet. You can feel it when it's still wet. When you come back with the rag, if it poo, if it pulls you, that's when it's still too wet. So you just wait a little bit. Come back, buff it, and you're done. Finito. Notice it still looks wet. That's it. That's it. Marble stone. Simple. Two coat application. KS first coat. First, a coat, first coat the primer. You want to put the primer on, the, the forensic primer with the acrylic quartz inside of it. Then the Marino KS. Then the marble stone. Then the cedar. You can put a wax or a soapstone. It doesn't really matter. And you're done. That's how you do marble stone.